All right, man. I'm telling you, the '80s had the best music. There's no argument. '80s music was and is revolutionary. Dude, no, no, I'm not arguing with you. The '80s was an influential time in music. I'm just saying, don't forget about all the greatness that came out when we were growing up. The 2000s, that music changed the game, bro. That music was shit in comparison. The music of today is weak. Talent's gone. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Time out. I'm not gonna let you just sit here and talk shit about talented artists of today. Gambino, uh, Miley Cyrus. 30 years from now, our kids will be sitting right here arguing about how influential their music was. Miley Cyrus? Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> yeah, Miley. The only reason she'll be influential in 30 years <laughs> is because she's knocked off what Madonna was doing in the what? 80s. Oh, best song of the 80s. Go. Take on me. Wake me up before you go-go. Wake me up before you go-go? Take on me? Yeah, I guess I can see that. It's a good song. It's a good song. Nothing beats Wham, though. No. <laughs> God, damn, what do you think about her? Don't just make it obvious, man. All right, all right. She's sexy. Yeah, good idea with that back crack, too. Right? She's real sexy, but like mysterious kind of sexy, you know what I mean? I can hear you. You, you could hear us? You weren't exactly using your indoor voices. Hey, you can't smoke in here. Why the hell not? You're not from around here, are you? Do I look like I'm from around here? Hey, I'm sorry. I'm still trying to teach my boy Andy over here how to be a gentleman. Hey, tell you what. Why don't you scoot on over here and uh, my brother John will buy you a drink. I've never been one to pass up free booze. <laughs> All right. There you go. Hey, you know what? Take mine. Always do. So, uh, what's your name, sweetie? My name is Luca. Luca? Do you live on the second floor? I live upstairs. Yeah, yeah. I think I've seen you before. Oops. Uh, it's, uh, it's a Suzanne Vega joke. Uh, it's a song from the 80s. <laughs> right, uh, right. It's funny, we are just talking about 80s music too. Oh yeah? Favorite songs from the 80s? I said Take On Me. Andy over there said Wake Me Up Before You Go-Go. Predictable. Oh, is that so? And what's your favorite song from the 80s? I can talk 80s music all night. But how about we get a little alcohol in first? Three beers and a double shot of whiskey. What do you boys have? Add on two shots of tequila, hold the salt. <laughs> Always did like a girl who could drink. One of my many things. Gentlemen. All right. To a great night with new friends. <laughs> I need a smoke. I'll be back, boys. <laughs> All right. Three more beers. You got it. Yeah, that Luca girl's pretty cool, huh? Yeah. Thanks, buddy. Thank you. Hey, hold up. What the fuck are you doing, bro? <laughs> Dude, do you think I'm going to pass up an opportunity like this? No, 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 no. No, you can't do that. That's not right. Dude, what's with the change of heart? I remember us buying this shit together. Yeah, well, she's different. Different? How? You like this girl or something? Oh, and what about that girl three weeks ago? I guess she didn't mean shit to you, right? I, I just don't see the difference now. Look, we bought this stuff, and I'm gonna make sure we use it. You already fucked up our chances with that Lila girl three Layla, weeks ago. Lila, whatever, you fucked up. Now, what you don't understand is these girls want to fuck. They just need a little extra help getting me. Whatever. Another beer? Just one more before we go, go. Let me argue to me. Oh. I got you, sweetie. I'm about ready to get out of here. What about you guys? More then. 
you can say that. Come on, sweetheart. Wait. Do you have any toothpicks? Oh, yeah. Thanks. Hey, what? You're building a damn birdhouse? <laughs> John, John, bro, John, I'm telling you, it couldn't be any better, dude. Every time we go out, it's the same thing, dude. Perfect. Every single time. <laughs> I don't feel so hot, man. Bro. <laughs> bro. <laughs> dude, are you okay? John, you sick. Stand up, dude. What's going on with you? Dude. Ouch. Does that hurt? You know, every time I do that, it never gets any easier. You crazy bitch! Oh, Oh, come on, Andy. I know I'm a woman and all, but give me some credit. Just admit what you tried to do to me, and I give you my word, I won't hurt you anymore, and I'll let the both of oh, you go. Okay. Okay. I'm sorry. It was stupid. Just let me go. It was a mistake. It was stupid. Admit what you tried to do. We, we, tried, we tried to, okay? I'm sorry. Oh, no, I'm sorry. No. I'm you sorry. John. <laughs> when I'd accidentally dropped my cigarettes, I switched beers with him. Now look at him. He looks like a little roofie whore. I'm sorry! What I'm I want to know I'm is sorry. what you planned on doing with me after you drugged me. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. That's not my fucking question! <laughs> what was that, Andy? I'm sorry. Come on. You're sorry, you're sorry for we're gonna, what? We're gonna try. Say it louder, say it prouder. We're gonna rape you, okay? Alright? I know. What is what is that? You said you wouldn't hurt me anymore. I lied. You're not very smart, are you? No, you're not. The fact that you think Wake Me Up Before You Go-Go was the greatest song of the 80s should have been a dead fucking giveaway. You tried to stick me, so now no. I'm gonna try and stick no. you. The only difference is, oh. I'll be successful. <laughs> it's just a little prick. Much like what's between those legs of yours, I'm sure. <laughs> Nice shot, Andy. But you hit like a little bitch. You know, it's people like you who made me who I am today. You're <laughs> fucking psycho. No, Andy. I'm not crazy. What's crazy is people who think they can get away with raping innocent women, dragging their 80s obsessed friend along with them. Mm. Don't worry, John, I haven't forgotten about you. Mm. I see what was in that syringe is taking effect. Your heart rate is slowing, blood pressure is dropping. I'd imagine it's all quite terrifying. Does your skin feel tingly, Andy? I bet it does. It makes your nerves hypersensitive, but renders you completely incapable of movement. Basically, you are totally vulnerable, just like those innocent women that you took advantage of. How does that feel, Andy? He 
teeny meeny miny mo catch a rapist by his toe if he hollers let him go eeny meeny miny mo too bad you can't holler huh Are you ready for the climax? Ugh. <sighs>